Good morning, East Texas. I'm Tom Mitzoff, and this is the TylerPaper.com Morning News Update. The movie theater gunman who stood up about 20 minutes into the showing of Trainwreck in Lafayette, Louisiana, and began firing into the crowd, killing two people, was described as a drifter from Alabama whose escape plan was thwarted by police officers who arrived almost immediately, authorities said today. The gunman killed himself. At this point, we have three dead, uh, nine wounded. Uh, of the three dead, one is definitely the shooter. A lot of people left purses and shoes and things in, in place and, and immediately left the theater. And so, uh, you know, we have a lot, a lot of those things to look at and recover. And, um, you know, it's a pretty horrific scene with that many people being shot. Um, it's, it's pretty horrific is what I'm told. The gunman, identified as 59-year-old John Russell Hauser, fired at least 13 times from a handgun, police said. He had parked his car by the theater's exit door and initially tried to escape by blending into the fleeing crowd. But he turned back when he saw police heading inside from the parking lot, authorities said. Officers tailing him back into the theater then heard a single gunshot and found him dead inside. Authorities did not release a motive. That's the big question. That's, the, that's what everybody is wondering. Why, why would this guy come here to this theater and just start randomly shooting people? We, we just, we, it's too early to, to have any of those answers. Authorities said Hauser had been living in the Lafayette area since early July, staying at a motel where they found disguises, including glasses and wigs. His 1995 blue Lincoln Continental had a license plate on it that did not match the car. This morning's featured Focus in on Dot Me Photo Gallery was taken by our Travis Tapley at the Daddy-Daughter Date Night last night at the Tyler Rose Garden Center. All the photos are available for purchase. Visit Focus in on Dot Me by clicking the photos link at the top of any telepaper.com page. Thanks for watching and tune in for more updates as the day progresses.